Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am so happy to see you here. And today, as you can see from the title, I'm going to be talking about 30 things that I learned in 30 years of living. I recently had my birthday and I turned 30 and it was kind of like a monumental day for me just because entering a new de decade is always a big deal and this is the decade where I'm supposed to be an adult and know what I'm doing and I don't know, it just got me thinking about what I have done in the last 30 years, what I want to achieve in the next 30 years and I just really felt like doing this kind of more deep talking down, sit down video for you and uh, kind of sharing the lessons that I learned. Some of them are lighthearted, some of them aren't, but all of these are something that definitely shaped me into the person who I am today. I hope that they are going to be useful for you as well, especially if you are younger than me. One thing that I can tell you already by now, I wish I listened to older people when I was younger and I didn't have to do so many mistakes of my own. So if you can learn from some of these from me, then you will be already way more ahead of me. And just last thing before we get started, if you like this video, if you like any of the other videos, I would highly appreciate if you would subscribe to my channel. And starting from next week, I'm actually starting to do Vlogmas, which means that I will be posting a video every single day for you in December leading up to Christmas. And there will be so much fun and interesting content. So make sure to subscribe to not miss any of that. And of course, to give a little support to me and join into this corner of the internet of mine. Uh, but now let's go and get started because there's quite a lot of things that I want to share with you. Failure is just a stepping stone to success. Every failure teaches you something. And most often the most successful people are the ones that have failed the most because that means that they have actually gone and tried to do things instead of just thinking about it. It is okay to outgrow friendships. Sometimes you just evolve in other ways that other people don't and that's totally okay. Growth happens outside of your comfort zone. The most transformative time of your life often comes when you push yourself and do something that you are uncomfortable with. Work and life balance is essential. Putting work before everything else will just lead you to burnout. You teach people how to treat you. Boundaries and self-respect are so important and in the end of the day, you are the one who shows people how they are allowed to treat you. You can't please everyone. Trying to please everyone will just lead you to burnout and honestly, I think you should just focus to the core group of people that really matters to you listen to what they have to tell you and don't care about anyone else networking is about genuine connections not just talking relationships in your career will be so much meaningful when they actually become just that relationships it is not just about transactions your mental health is just as important as your physical health we are all used to taking care of our physical bodies, but taking care of your mental health is just as important, if not more vital. And there are a lot of things that you can do to improve that. No job is worth your happiness. Your job should bring you fulfillment, not stress. If it's draining you, I think it is time to search for something new. People will come and go, but the right ones will stay with you. Not everyone is meant to stay in your life forever, and that's okay, but the ones that are will always find a way back to you and into your life. It's okay to ask for help. No matter if it's your personal or professional life, asking for help does not make you weak. It actually makes you smart and strong because you are able to see when you are not able to do the things by yourself. Be your own biggest advocate. No one knows your worth better than you, so just speak up and actually make the opportunities happen. Love yourself before you expect anyone else to love you. Self-love is the foundation to building healthy, loving and trustful relationships with others. The only thing that is sure in life is change. There is always going to be change happening in your life. Life is evolving and learning how to adapt to change is what will make you thrive. Success looks different for everyone. Success is not always about the titles or the money. Everyone has their own journey. So, and the only one that can measure the success is you. Don't settle for less than you deserve in a relationship. Whether it's friendship or family or romantic relationships, you deserve to be treated with respect. So you shouldn't settle for anything less. Patience is virtue. Things don't always happen, and if I may say, almost never happen on your timeline, but sometimes it is absolutely worth to wait for the right timing. The learning never stops. Continuous learning is crucial, whether it's for your personal or professional life. 
small habits lead to big changes. It's about the little things that you do every day, the exercising, walking, your eating habits and who you hang out with. Not everyone is going to understand your journey and that is absolutely okay. People will not always understand your decisions and why you are doing those things and it doesn't matter. In the end of the day, it is your life so you should do what you think is the most important for your journey. Follow your passion, but definitely know when to be practical. While passion is of course super important, it is also important to know when to blend it with practical. Rest is just as important as work. It may sound cliche, but you cannot pour out of an empty cup, so make sure to fill your own cup first. Time is so much more valuable than money. You can always make more money, but you can never make up the time that you lost. In friendships, quality definitely over quantity. It is not about how many friends you are, it is about how deep connections you have. Life is too short to hold grudges. Let go of all the anger and resentment. It will fill up space in your heart for other more positive feelings and emotions. There is no such thing as perfect timing. Just go for it. Waiting for everything to line up perfectly and be the perfect opportunity will actually lead you to just not pursue the opportunity that you want to do. Just go for it, take the leap, even if the time isn't perfect, because you can make it perfect. Communication is key to healthy relationships. Open and honest communication helps to prevent misunderstanding and also builds trust. Travel expands your perspective. Experiencing different cultures and meeting new people will teach you so much about the world World, but also yourself. It's okay to say no. Saying no doesn't automatically mean that you are being rude. It just means that you are prioritizing yourself. It's okay to be a beginner. You don't need and you cannot know everything from the start. Be kind to yourself and embrace the learning process. No one starts at a professional level. So we have reached the end of the video. I hope you liked this more informative and a little bit different video on my channel and I hope you got some lessons out of it for yourself. Let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite. And I will see you again right next week for Vlogmas. If you wait for everything... Ah! What the hell? So... <laughs> see? Ah! Oh, I'm so lieb! Fuck off! Oh, uh. Your job should bring you fulfillment. Your job should bring you fulfillment. Your job should bring you fulfillment.